Hello guys and welcome to another tutorial. In this tutorial we're going to be solving 1154A, restoring three numbers. Alright, so it says that Polycap has guessed three positive integers A, B, and C. He keeps these numbers in secret, but he writes down four numbers on a board in arbitrary order. There are bitwise sum three numbers and sum of all three numbers one number and sum of all three numbers one number. I don't know, sometimes I wonder who writes these problems. So there are four numbers on a board in random order. A plus B, A plus C, B plus C, and A plus B plus C. You have to guess three numbers A, B, C using the given numbers. Print three guessed integers in any order. Pay attention that some are given numbers A, B, C can be equal. It is also possible that A is equal to B is equal to C. Hmm. Okay. So what we really care about is, so if we're given three numbers, right? We add two numbers, so A and B, A and C, and B and C, and A, B, C. Okay, so let me look at this. So we're given one, two, three, four, so the output becomes two, one, three, right? All right, so we know that these numbers, one, two, and three, are going to be less than this number because we're adding three numbers here and we're only adding two numbers here. So it makes sense that for this problem, what we do is we take the biggest number Right, and then we subtract it from any of these numbers here. And that should give us the numbers that we're looking for. So uh, in this case, it should be 6 is the biggest number. So 6 minus uh, 3 is 3, right? 6 minus 4 is 2, and 6 minus 5 is 1. And since the order doesn't really matter, it can be in any form, right? So we can try this for the next input, which is 60. 60 minus 40 is four is 20, 20, 20, which matches this. So we're good. Now, at least I know how to implement it. So let's go ahead and um, work on this problem. Um, so we're given, so we'll just have four elements in every input. So we can, yeah, let's actually work through that. All right, so let's uh, add in some uh, input. I'm gonna do a uh, STD. H. Let's do a type def of uh, unsigned uh, long long uh, int uh, URL and let's do main. Alright, so we need our four elements. Let's say uh, URL and then let's say. Uh, to uh, inputs, and this is going to be four, and then we also need to keep track of our largest. So, I'm going to do a uh, largest here, it's going to equal to zero for now, and then, uh, well, we need to loop over our values. So, I'm going to make an index here. And then we can go through a for loop. But so, yeah, so we just do go to the for loop. So for uh, index is equal to zero, and index is uh, less than four, uh, plus plus index. All right, so now we can take our value, say uh, scan f. Uh, and 
to and the input I take in the uh, index. Alright, so now I'm going to say that if the uh, largest is less than the current uh, number, so it should be uh, inputs, uh, inputs, inputs, and then uh, take in the index. Then we're going to make this the uh, current largest. We're going to say the largest. It's going to equal to uh, inputs. Pass in the uh, index. Now we're done with the first for loop. Now we can go to the second for loop where we actually need to print out the values. So the index is going to equal to 0. And index is less than 4. Uh, index plus plus. Alright, so we're going to say that if um, if largest right zor uh, input uh, index all right so we're saying that if Okay, so if if we don't need to include the number that's the largest there, so in this case, if we zor the number, right, the current the largest with the current number, it should be zero. So which means that the if statement will not execute in this case. So in this case, if the numbers are the same, it will not execute. If they're not, what we're going to do is print f. And we're going to do uh, percent RLU. And what we're going to do is print the uh, largest uh, minus the current value. So it's going to be uh, inputs. And then we're going to pass in the uh, index. All right. So the values were th 3, 6, 5, and 4. So let's actually uh, be able to run this. All right, so it should be uh, three, six, five, and four. You should get uh, three, one, two. All right, so. got a uh, three one two so it doesn't matter what the order is um it should be fine all right so let's go ahead here and copy this and go back to code forces uh, paste and submit here see still stalling on case one so I don't know if it's gonna pass <laughs> all right so it says that it's wrong so let's go ahead and see exactly um, what happened
Okay, so I think I know what the problem is. Um, this thing is very picky. So we can go back and uh, include the uh, the Zor back, and we just need to add a space here because I think that without the space is actually thrown. This is an error. All right, so let's copy this again. And if that's the case, I would really be sad. All right, and uh, go back to the problem. Submit and paste. Hit that again. Ah, and it's actually running. Oh, <laughs> so it was the space that was the problem. We needed to make sure it was space separated. All right, guys, this will be it for this problem. I'll see you guys in the next one.